So it was time now to send out letters to of inquiry about jobs. So I thought, well, Washington, D.C., be close to Baltimore, where my wife's family is, and uh, my family's in New York, so that's not too far, just four hours away. Okay, fine. So that's what uh, I did. I, I applied for a job in uh, various government agencies in Washington, D.C., and I got a letter. I got one back one day, and I was so excited. And at this time, I was living in the dorm. So uh, I ran into my room, and I opened the envelope, took the letter out, and, well, you know, it was uh, how the government is. They have to send out so many. It's not a personal letter. The letters go out all over the United States, and they have to print hundreds of them. And then they just check off things, uh, a form letter. This, this is what this was. It was a notice of, um, uh, hmm, I forgot what it was. Um, notice of acceptance, I guess. Okay. So I was looking at the letter, and there was, oh, oh, yes, it was um, eligibility notice. That's what it was. And there were two columns. One column said the, the, the eligible, and then the other column was the non-eligible. I read down the eligible column. Not there. We looked on the non-eligible, and there was my name checked there as not eligible due to medical reasons. And I thought, what in the world does that mean? I've got, uh, I looked at my shoes, I've got my feet and my ten toes that wiggle, and my shoes and my feet move, my legs move, my breathe all right, my stomach's okay, I can bend over okay, my back's all right, I got arms, I'm fine, my chest is fine. What's wrong with my heart? It's okay. My tongue, my throat, my nose, my eyes, my ear. Uh-oh. Then I went into a state of shock. For the first time, I was scared. Deaf. I'm deaf. Wait a minute now. Wait a minute. This is silly. High school, three years in high school, working to prove that a deaf person could do this all by themselves, no interpreter, nothing. And then in college, four years all alone, no interpreter, no one helping me, doing everything all myself, and now after these, this I'm ready, and the hearing world says, no, you can't because you're deaf.